مستا ما بوهاي ما جندان جبي and welcome back to MGN Diego. أقرب وسيلة لا and before we even start the video, I'd like to thank my beautiful Pinoy community for listening to my beat, my new beat that I made after a long five year break okay and you guys really seemed to enjoy it and a lot of you are telling me that it sounds like a popular uh, Filipino hip-hop song so I'm very interested I might react to it just to compare it to my beat you know and yeah you guys suggested multiple Filipino artists to rap on it so if you think that there is a Filipino artist that could rap on it, don't hesitate to send them the link, okay? Also, be my guest. You can download the beat and rap on it yourself and sing on it yourself if you want to. But yeah, I just wanted to thank you guys for listening to it and yeah, and for sharing it. Thank you so much. Maraming maraming salamat po. Uh, but yeah, we are here today because... What? Nicole Scherzinger, who we all know is half Filipina and I believe German, if I'm not mistaken, sang a song in Tagalog. Yes, indeed. All right. And it's called Pangako. Okay. And uh, it's not just her. It's with uh, Troy Loretta. Okay. That sounds like a... It's weird. Troy is a man's name, but Loretta sounds female you know but i think it's a guy troy loretta never heard of him so i'm guessing this is going to be a duet and man i wonder if nicole scherzinger is gonna have a tagalog accent uh sorry a uh, an english accent while speaking tagalog you know i don't know if i'll be able to tell i don't know but we'll see i'm very interested um, all right, but before we start, please consider following me on Instagram at Music Game News. And without further ado, let's get to it. Okay, to my ears, she sounds fantastic. Wow. Hey, maybe, maybe she knows how to speak Tagalog. You know, maybe she was taught at a very young age. I don't know. Wait. Quality is fantastic. It really sounds super clear. You know, like you can really enjoy every frequency, you know? Wonderful. This song sounds familiar. Have I ever reacted to this song before? Who's the original singer? I know that part. Question, are they uh, making it their own or not? Did they, you know, take the original instrumental and just sang on it, you know? Or did they change it a little bit? Let me know in the comment section below. Maybe I should also react to the original. See, she didn't say E1, right? She said E1. -E so she pronounced both eyes. Beautiful. 
See, um, Nicole Scherzinger is a very versatile artist because she made it as a pop star, right? Like she was making urban music, pop music, and it worked, you know, with her group uh, Pussycat Dolls. Yes, when she went solo, it did, she did not succeed as much, but still. And you all know that she also has a big voice, like she can belt, she can even sing opera, you know, so she's extremely versatile. Do you enjoy the back of vocals that they're using here? Beautiful. Okay, so is she the only one singing? I thought Troy Loretta was also a singer. It would have been nice, you know, to hear a male voice, you know, to balance uh, Nicole Scherzinger's, uh, you know, female voice. It would have been nice, but I feel like she's gonna be singing the entire thing. So maybe Troy Loretta is not actually a singer. Maybe he's just a producer, record producer, songwriter, you know, maybe. <laughs> It really makes me want to listen to the original so that I can compare the two. I have to now. I have to. It got so epic towards the end. I did not expect that. They even included, I believe, electric guitars. about you guys but this song reminds me of like the intro songs of popular animes I don't know why All right, so I'm confused, all right? So I, I have no idea why it says Troy Loretta. I believe Troy Loretta is the one who did the whole thing, okay? Maybe he's the one who composed a new version of Pangako and invited Nicole Scherzinger to sing on it, okay? So he's probably like the composer, music producer, and all that jazz, you know? Because I never heard of Troy Loretta, you know? So maybe that's what it is. She did beautifully. Honestly, she sang it so well. And, you know, I'm no expert, but I think that her Tagalog accent was on point. Really. Uh, the song is nice, you know. It's not really my type of music, but I am intrigued by the original. So I'd like to know who sang the original. And uh, yeah, I'm probably gonna check it out. I don't know if I will react to it or just listen to it, you know, 
on my own time so that I can have a better idea of uh, the extent of which they changed the song, you know? Um, but yeah, let me know in the comment section below your thoughts on her version and I guess Troy Loretta's version as well. I am a little bit disappointed that this was not a duet, I have to admit, but it is what it is. So yeah, let me know in the comment section below your thoughts. Marami maraming salamat po. Thank you so much for joining me as usual, and I will catch you in the next video as usual. Peace. Thank you for watching. Subscribe here and please like the video to show your support and appreciation for my work and turn on the notification bell to be boxed for future content. Yeah, yeah, yeah.